My grandfather was a voodoo priest. A lot of my life dealt with spirituality. I can close my eyes and remember where I come from. Wyclef Jean. I'm Mike with List 25, and here are 25 true things you may not know about voodoo. Twenty-five, Voodoo's Roots Voodoo is a spiritual expression that blends together indigenous African religions with animism and spiritism. Sometimes shamanism and witchcraft are also thrown into the fray. 24. The Two Worlds Voodooists hold central to their belief that there are two interrelated worlds, the visible and the invisible. Death separates us from the invisible world where our ancestors still watch over us. 23. The Most Famous Versions of Voodoo Voodoo is most known in three places, West Africa, Haiti, and Louisiana. Beyond there, it's sometimes practiced in places which had many West African slaves, such as Cuba, Brazil, Puerto Rico, and the Dominican Republic. 22. One God Most voodooists believe in a supreme being, though the deity is more distant and less accessible than lesser spirits. This monotheistic religion refers to God as Bandeye. 21. The Iwa All voodoo practitioners are known for interacting with lesser spirits, often called Iwa. The spirits often differ between branches, and some have even been merged with Catholic saints after the collision of European Christianity and African voodoo. 20. Relationship with the Iwa Voodooists develop relationships with the Iwa to ask their advice and learn from their experience and connect with them on a spiritual level. 19. The Iwa and Nature All of the Iwa are connected to some sort of natural force, such as Ogu, the male Iwa of iron and metallic powers. 18. Voodoo's Status in Haiti Voodoo is protected under the 1987 Haitian Constitution, but this wasn't always the case. In an attempt to ostracize the religion, the Catholic Church burned voodoo shrines and beat its clergy in the late 1940s and early 1950s. 17. Voodoo Teachings Voodoo does not have a leader nor definitive scriptures. 16. Voodoo dolls aren't really a thing. The commonly cited voodoo dolls aren't entirely voodoo dolls, but rather come from a type of African folk magic named hoodoo. The dolls, often made to transfer a curse onto somebody, are made from corn shafts, potatoes, plant matter, clay, or clothes. Despite Hollywood's overhyping of the dolls, they are not used by most voodoo practitioners. 15. Communication with the Iwa Voodooists communicate with lesser spirits through prayer, animal sacrifice, possessions, and drum-slash-dance ceremonies. 14. Clergy and Voodoo Men and women can be ordained as clergy in the voodoo religion and are known as Hugan and Mambo, respectively. Though they can offer advice to followers, it's maintained that everyone is individually capable of their own enlightenment. A strong sense of community is nonetheless one of the central tenets of voodooism. 13. Voodoo was banned in Saint-Domingue In 1685, France banned any practicing of African religions in their colony of Saint-Domingue. Slave owners were required to Christianize their slaves within eight days of arrival, and many were baptized. Slaves didn't give up their native religions, but rather merged them with Catholicism to give the appearance to the slave drivers that they had converted. 12. New Orleans Voodoo's Roots The voodoo tradition in Louisiana, and especially New Orleans, was brought by African and Creole slaves freeing the Haitian Revolution at the end of the 18th century. 11. A voodoo priest starts the Haitian Revolution. Bookman Duddy, a voodoo priest, is widely recognized as starting the Haitian Revolution after making prophecies and declaring leaders at a religious ceremony in August 1791. 10. The Centrality of Healing Central to voodoo is healing people from illnesses. Herbs are used, and the Iwa are invoked to heal the sick. 9. The Origin of the Word Voodoo The word voodoo comes from the West African language of Fon and means spiritual entity. 
The Fon were and are an ethnic and linguistic group mainly centered around southern Benin. 8. The Legendary Voodoo Queen The legendary Creole voodoo queen, Mary Laveau, was well known in New Orleans and has been featured in numerous movies and books. Legend says if you draw an X on her tomb, turn around three times, knock on the tomb, and scream out your wish, the voodoo queen will grant it. Unfortunately, the tomb has recently been closed to the general public due to vandalism. 7. Possession in Voodoo Voodooists believe the Iwa can possess a worshipper's body during certain religious ceremonies. It's also believed the soul can escape from the body while dreaming and during possession by an Iwa. 6. St. Peter as Papa Legba In Haitian voodoo, St. Peter is known as Papa Legba, the gatekeeper to the spirit world, similar to his position as gatekeeper to heaven in the Catholic tradition. 5. The reason for animal sacrifice The practice of sacrificing an animal during a voodoo ceremony is to give life energy to the Iwa. The killing releases life, which helps rejuvenate the Iwa who have been busy managing the universe. 4. Current Day Adherence About 4 million people in Benin and 5 million in Haiti adhere to voodoo today, among others in smaller groups across the world. 3. Voodoo follows a moral code Contrary to a false myth perpetuated in the late 1800s to discredit African religions, Voodoo has never included human sacrifice. Such an act would contradict its moral code, which strictly prohibits the harming of others. 2. Traditional Voodoo Law Enforcement Zangbedos are the traditional night guards in Benin and Togo. Made up of a man in a costume resembling a haystack, the Zangbedo are traditional Voodoo guardians who patrol the streets at night and, if falling into a trance, can even be possessed by an Iwa. Before the establishment of official law enforcement, the Zangbedos were the primary force of law in Benin. 1. Voodoo's True Self Overall, Voodoo is not about black magic and spells, but rather a community-based religion which focuses on healing and doing well to others. The religion helped African slaves persevere through harsh working conditions and continues to inspire and invigorate its millions of modern-day practitioners. Enjoying our lists? Be sure to click that subscribe button in the top right corner so you don't miss out on new ones every Monday through Friday. Share them with your friends and help us consistently conciliate curiosity. And if you want even more lists, check out these two videos here or just head to our website at list25.com.